following a quick meetup with subscribers, visiting Magellan's Cross and other landmarks such as Basilica Minore del Santo Niño de Cebu, and exploring other historical areas and what's around, we finally had to conclude the last leg of our tour, leaving the Queen City of the South and heading back to Manila. After our vacation in Palawan and stopping for an overnight stay in Cebu, it was time for us to go home. Finding ourselves in Mactan Cebu Airport Terminal 1, travel buddy Aliyah and I make our way past the electronic gates, having our boarding passes scanned and verified so we can proceed onwards to catch our pilot express flight. For the many times I've visited this airport, it has always given a certain feel. Being a major jump-off point to different islands in the Philippines, it surely sets a mood that spells vacation. With our flight still hours away, we hung out at one of the restaurants in this terminal and explored around a bit before proceeding to the Mabuhay Lounge to escape from all the noise and chaos at the waiting area. After greeting familiar faces at the Mabuhay Lounge, we thought that this is one place where we can grab some dessert, from fresh fruits to a variety of pastries, along with free-flowing drinks that's all in the house for business class passengers and elite members. The Mabuhay Lounge is also a good place where you can simply chill out and relax while backing up some files and charging your gadgets. It's an exclusive place where you can just settle down a bit and just be. Soon, the boarding process for our flight is announced, and we're off to board our A321 aircraft bound for Manila. Stop the plane. Well, it's nice to see familiar faces again with one of the crew members featured in my blog some time ago. Meanwhile, I'm sure by now you know where my favorite seat is. Yup, it's at the backmost part of the cabin. And since it's an evening flight with nothing much to see outside, I had Aliyah take my window seat. This is her first evening flight by the way, so I didn't really mind. Perhaps I'll simply enjoy the view of the entire cabin from my aisle seat. Shortly after, we were on a roll and taking off for Manila. <laughs> Takeoff is one accelerating phases of air travel. For Aliyah, she kind of gets nervous whenever the plane lifts into the air. But once the aircraft makes a steady ascent, she gets relieved that is able to go back to what she likes doing, taking photos and video clips of her plane ride. Some passengers would take photos of the view seen outside the window. For me, if it's an evening flight, there's not really much to see except the lights down below that get smaller and smaller as the plane ascends. Worse is that ordinary camera lenses cannot exactly capture what human eyes can see during the dark. So as much as possible, I try to travel during the day rather than at night. And while seatbelt signs still on and our plane climbing to cruising altitude, I dig through my seat pocket to check its contents. 
As an airline enthusiast, I have the habit of checking out the latest issue of our in-flight magazine. Not only to scan through the write-ups, but to check out what's new in this airline's network of routes on both domestic and international. Once our aircraft has leveled, in-flight snacks were soon served. I'm just wondering what happened to the sky treats as lately, they've been serving snacks like lava cakes instead. Yup, it's a short flight from Cebu to Manila. And once we started to descend into the clouds, the aircraft simply got shaky, which became quite uncomfortable to some passengers, most especially to Aliyah. Now this is also one phase of the flight that Aliyah dislikes, as pressure would build and hurt her ears. With crew members preparing for landing, I assured Aliyah that descent won't last that long. However, for Aliyah, the discomfort just seems to take forever. I told Aliyah how to find relief in popping the pressure out of her ears, but this time, she felt a bit nauseous. We can only wait for the plane to get to a certain altitude for the discomfort to go away. And when it did, Aliyah was finally okay and was back taking photos and clips of our approach. It was time to disembark, and since we're not in a rush, we had all the passengers go ahead. With the plane almost empty, I consider this was one of the best times to ask the crew if we can have a visit at the flight deck and have photos taken with the crew. There are times we get turned down as turnaround had to be quick, but in this case, we're lucky to have this chance again. Finally, we're back in Manila after almost a week of vacation. For Aliyah, it's back to school soon, and for me, it's back to work the next day. For now, we're just savoring the remaining time we have while at the airport. We arrived in Terminal 2 where most flights by Philippine Airlines is located. After exiting the plane, we head off to baggage claim to collect our stuff and to conclude this vlog before eventually heading home. Heading to uh, baggage claim, and uh, this is Aliyah's first time here in Terminal Two. Two, yeah, tama. Two. <laughs> Yun. Alah, di pa lumalabas yung mga bags. 
Anyhow, um, nothing fancy um, nangyari, except that we've uh, seen familiar faces and uh, yeah, it's good to see them again. Thank you very much for watching. My bag. <laughs> Thank you. Sige, thank you for watching. Bye. Ali says bye. 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 My next one. Okay, we're here now in the uh, Bank of Thailand with Owen, with blogger Hi. Owen Travels. Watch my videos as well. Owen yeah. Travels. Uh, so we're, we tied it up. With, we're doing collaborations. So if you notice, uh, the succeeding videos time for some time, kami yan. Uh, we are traveling to Thailand, to Singapore, from Cebu. And then we're trying to try out um, Silk Air and uh, Singapore Airlines. And later on, Shia sa Asiana. Asiana A380. Yeah. So, more of our collaboration. May kita mo yung behind the scenes. Kung paano gumukuha ng videos. Saka yung mga kapalpakan namin. <laughs> Anyhow, Owen Travels. So, be sure to, to uh, yeah, write watch. the what's uh, written there. Owen Travels. So, see you from, uh, from back of Thailand. Thank you very much for watching. Bye. Bye.